Today, lacrosse is generally known as a white sport. Even though it was started by indigenous people, part of the story that isn't told is that black people have also been playing for much longer than previously believed because many escaped and free enslaved people married into native tribes. Stickball, which was the original name for the game, was invented centuries ago by Native American Indian Algonquin tribe. The original plot of the game was for tribal warriors for training, recreation, and religious reasons, which indefinitely progressed into the great sport today, lacrosse. DNA testing shows us that a large number of Native American and Black people are related or closely connected. This started during the colonial era, and according to the Journal of American History, it increased after the rise of the American Revolution. This is because the African Americans and Native Americans were often driven out of the white societies. They were both outcasts, and this was the biggest factor for intermarriage. Even though lacrosse today is 83% white athletes at the collegiate level, we believe that African Americans were playing lacrosse before white people. We had Straight Hair, who was a Native American Salisbury student and lacrosse player, what he thinks the future of lacrosse will look like for black people and Native people. So I think that um, with the PLL, the Pro Lacrosse League, Premier Lacrosse League, uh, they're doing a great job of expanding and you know um, spreading awareness for Native Americans and also for Black people. They they did the Black Lives Matter movement last season and um, they they posted for uh, National Aboriginal Abrig Abrig Month. So that's this month and. Um, they're really they're they're using Lyle as their their source, and he's doing a great job of you know telling the story of lacrosse, um, educating the people that don't know, and I just think that if they continue on the path that they're going, then you know they just need another spokesperson you know for the years to come because Lyle ain't always going to be there, and um, I just I, I I really I really think that lacrosse is expanding.